Hello Internet, this is Sparrow Navaria, and today I plan to talk about delay lasers. Although this is completely different from the flow, or whatever flow there was, regarding ellipses and circles, I will be doing, I guess, random techniques and more specific things than, like, general how to do Danmakfu for my tutorials. And I was thinking about rotation matrices, which is rotating ellipses and stuff. AJS did something really awesome with that. I don't think I'm capable of explaining it, nor am I capable of using it without having to try things multiple times. Stages are a little complicated, and trying to rewind is pretty hard in the limited amount of time I can actually devote, because one takes about an hour to install, and I'm not going to reinstall the entire thing with Xcode and all that stuff. So, delay lasers. Yep. I will be setting up the folder for delay lasers and basically oops wrong folder tutorial B B uh, tutorial B Okay, um let me rename that. And I'm gonna be putting the text for delay lasers because that makes things easier. And this is sort of outdated now. I'll just clear out what we had yesterday. 120 frames is standard-ish. I prefer things are divisible by 60 because that's 60 frames in a second. Okay, I'm gonna get this ready. So I was thinking about what I was gonna do for a moment and Another thing, I'm going to switch that one to a zero so I can use patchly. Um, yeah, I, I'm just going to open the folder again so I can copy stuff over. Um, patchly, do I have her images? Cut in, sprite, sprite, okay. Do I have her stuff? Uh, patchly is, uh, yeah, patchly is. And it says patchy, which is good. There have been cases where it says something completely different and then I have to fix it afterwards. Does she have a charge effect? Yes, she does have a charge effect. Okay. That means I just need to copy over the f delay laser code. And I don't have to worry about patchy. Uh, P, patchy, what am I going to do? Okay. Delay lasers. Actually, I'm not going to use this because it's sort of outdated. Um, what did I use for delay lasers last? Um, I did use them in... This is not spell one. Yeah, it's from Tenshi. I know was, I'm not gonna... Should I? It's not good for explaining. Actually it is, but... Okay. Um, this code for delay lasers is really old actually because I made it a long time ago when I was doing my artifact no, my Land of Code Apertures 4 contest entry a long time ago. That's when I first started PH3. And I was I actually had problems with delay lasers because I if you actually create a laser with delete time, which is DT here, of zero, the laser graphic will actually spawn and that actually looks pretty weird. I'm going to just um, to show that in a moment because it's actually pretty important if you're actually trying to do this stuff. Delay lasers spawn naturally when you have um, a create straight laser A1 or any straight laser basically. They always spawn as like so that the player knows to get out of the way and their width is based on the width that is set for the entire laser. However, you can use the lasers for more than just this. So, for example, you can use them for any type of bullet that's coming from the bottom of the screen. Very fast bullets, which is very common. And even other lasers that are traveling along the delay laser. And they have a lot of uses. So, I'm going to be going over that and um, some things to avoid, as well as some things that work well. So, let's see. I'm going to show you. Sh uh, if I can run it without the computer overheating, I will show you shadows thing if I have it here. And why is this? Okay, loaded. 
Okay, um, I just looked back at the video I recorded. CK, I'm very sorry that I put you on the spotlight for the wrong reason. Um, and let me quickly fix the actual reason I opened the folder. Which was to get her draw loop. And I did not do that. Mid boss, mid boss, doesn't really matter which one. Okay, now I'll actually draw Patchily instead of Tenshi and have it. Yeah, it would be really strange if. Ten Patchily's name is Zerbo is actually drawing Tenshi. This is for later. Um, this, this is um, Artifact too, okay. Shadows, do I have it? I might. Shadow Sage, oh my god, that thing does not work on the computer without crashing something. Ah, I do have it. Um, do I really have to, um, let's see. Practice MD. I think this is the one that actually, oh my god, this video has so many. Uh, fast forward, fast forward, fast forward. I'm looking for the second, okay. Um, basically, you can see here that he used um, the delay lasers to show, um, well, with um, a co uh, in conjunction with bullets that f go along the delay lasers. And that's one of the most common uses of delay lasers. Although, this is probably way too hard. <laughs> um, this. And this attack has a really amazing usage of delay lasers, which is um, to spawn the patterns and paths the um, bullets would take from the sides and bottom of the screen. Which, no longer counts as cheap shotting, actually, unless you're not really good at um, dodging delay lasers. And, well, the graphics are pretty much, basically, make this really awesome and button work. Okay. Wow, the computer is overheating a little bit because of the excessive amount of effects. Okay. There should be nothing here. Okay, Patchy is actually she's charging without a sound effect. Um, although you probably can't hear the sound effect. Anyways, charge is right there. Did I say play sound effect? Char um, let me fix that. Okay, it's not fixing itself, which means that I probably mess something up. Uh, but we'll do that later. For now, I'm going to create the 0.12M working laser that does not work in page 3. Um, let object laser equals create straight laser and X get X. Ingo is going to be Although, no. T and all of that equal. Um, let's see, angle T, um, length, um, 512 is pretty standard. You might want to do 1024. Width, I'm just going to put 18 so that it actually shows. If you do it too thin, it's not actually going to show, and that's sort of bad. The lead time is going to be zero because it's technically delayed, so I'm just going to use a uh, Default. It's just, this is probably gray or red. Doesn't really matter. Delay. That's how long the actual laser will be in delay form. And we'll run this. Oh, what? Oh. Okay. Let's see what this does. As you can see, it's the delay laser with the laser itself. It's not killing me, but the graphic actually expands. This is, happens in PH3, but not in 0.12M, and this is a reason why I have that delay laser task. Oh, you can just you just saw there what happened, where she is um, dropping as she um, moved. Um, that's one of the things to avoid with delay lasers because it looks really strange if you fire something after the, um, the enemy has moved. If it's not like a Shikigami using enemy or something like that. Because, well, it just looks a little off. You might want to avoid that. 
It's best to spawn them on the um, on the actual boss sprite facing somewhere, or have a, a familiar do it or something similar to that. That way, it won't seem weird. Okay. Okay. Um, a few things that to, I had to mention. First, this get enemy X and get enemy Y is actually defined. So, yeah, I think I forgot to mention that. I have them defined as, um, oh, it's from Talos. Um, object move get X of the object and get Y of the object. Don't use get render because that will cause massive problems with object move, object render, because the graphics are controlled slightly differently. Um, and as object because in my um, LOCAA, I, don't, I have no clue how to pronounce in one so so I'll swipe. <laughs> um, contest entry, um, um, yeah, I had two bosses, so I needed to use that. I mean, it doesn't really shorten anything, but I'm used to it. Um, other thing is that the sound wasn't working for me because there was no sound folder. And that was sort of reckless of me. I have all kinds of sounds in here, which you won't get to hear, but I might as well put them in anyways. Okay. So now I'm going to use the um, legitimate delay laser and here goes delay laser. X, Y, angle, length, width, delay, time, graphic, and delay. Okay. My task, um, yeah, this is when I really loved 0.12 and they left the comment there and I've copied the comment everywhere. Um, although, I can't run 0 0.12 anymore, anymore, any, anymore. Wow. Um, so that doesn't really work. Um, this line, object straight laser, set source, object laser, false. This will prevent that weird delay cloud from spawning for the lasers. And it, the longer the delay, the bigger the delay cloud. So I can actually cover the entire screen if you're not careful. And then loop delay minus one. The, um, the expanding happens in the last frame, technically. So um, this prevents the graphic from ever enlarging. And um, wow, I actually swore here. That's yeah. This is one of the functions I had a little trouble learning how to use after I transitioned, but that's fine. Um, this is here so that if there's a delay laser and the spell ends, the delay laser doesn't stay onto the next spell, which has happened before, and it's really strange. It's just better to have the precaution there, and then afterwards I delete the laser so that it doesn't actually become a laser and just to clear the graphic away and the object memory. And um, this is basically a wait loop and I just out, I just basically wrote it as a loop a delay minus one. Um, I'll be using that. It should um, perform differently. And there. Ooh, I can hear the sound. And as you can see, it's not expanding. Which is the purpose. So that's how um, you can use this code. I'm just going to leave it here for a while so you can copy it down or whatever. You can actually take it in basically any one of my scripts that uses a delay laser. Um, and yeah. Uh, what else do I need? Oh, I should leave that out a little bit longer. Okay. An important thing to know is that you should never use someone else's code unless you understand what's actually going on. I'm just saying this now because this can be a little confusing, especially with that DT. You might have heard me say delay time when it's actually delete time. So yeah, that was just one of the precautions to worry about um, or not worry about. Yeah, um, what else? Okay. So apparently I don't have a spell skeleton. I'm going to turn this into a spell just so I can maybe it's patchily. It'll look prettier this way. Now let's sound, cut it in. And bossing start spell. It doesn't really matter because you don't have any. Oops. Okay. Oh yeah, Sublime. I'm using a free version, so that happens. And notify even all oh, 777 is the end scene, but it doesn't really work because yeah, I'm going to Make sure I have the correct dimensions for the cut-in script. 
Oh wow, she has. Oh, it's only four. It was just Tenchi's name having the same. Okay, now I'm gonna copy that. Now you notice that's zero one, and that's because um, when I was making Danmark for Do dodging for dummies page three, there was um, p apparently page three does some weird stuff if you put zero and zero, and I was like take the the um the bottommost pixel and place at the top, and it looks really weird. And no, this default. Spell name, which I've been using for forever, is not what I want. Um, let's see. Hmm. It's Patchily. And uh, by the way, I have a really bad naming thing going on. Skyfall. Hmm. No. Um. Okay, I'm just going to throw random adjectives and nouns in there and see what happens. Um, I'm going to change the graphic to something fitting, and I'm going to add actual bullets to the delay lasers. Um, let's see. Graphics. Okay. Right, because lighting lasers. No, that's not appropriate for this. Uh, for delay lasers, you will want to use straight lasers. Um, basically, this become if, because if you use like um, a spherical laser as your base, for it's a straight laser, so you actually have like fade out towards the both ends, and that actually can make the laser near invisible, which is a terrible idea if it's a delay laser. So yeah, just keep that in mind. Blue is 1007. I will use 1007 now. Okay, um, and I had to add something to that delay laser, it's not going to be like that anymore. Um, okay, I'm just going to remove this, and I'm going to turn this into something really gigantic. I don't know, zero, um, I'll just do 20. Laser, um, X, I'm going to use get stage frame, good, no. Uh, yeah, I frame width divided by 2019. Um, it's not actually going to be 20 because you want it to actually cover the entire screen-ish. Um, y is going to be 0 and it's going to be facing downwards. Oops, 90. And leave the rest the same. And then I'm going to ascent i in 0, j in 1 and 0. Um, five. Yeah, you have to use um. You so usually use I, J, and K, etc. for um that kind of thing. Create shot oh, A one. Yeah, some people when they transition they renamed their functions so that it would be like create shot A zero one. I mean O one. It's zero one. Yeah, it's been such a long time since I touched zero point oh M. Um, it's actually defined as create shot A one. I'm not. I didn't do that. I just suggested. Um, what should I do for this? I'm just going to choose a random bullet. Talismans, maybe? Right. Speed, 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 speed. Um, 2 plus i divided by 4. Um, let's see. Amulets are just, yeah, I'll just use uh, Apache with amulets. More, more Marasa's bullets. Marasa droplets. Okay, blue. 257. Standard thing. Okay. Um, yeah, this is a pretty common technique. Place. I don't have water. I do have water, but it's not there. Okay. Um, that closes that. That closes that. that okay. And there's no need for an extra weight. This is gonna do stuff. Um... Okay. And what happened to cut in? I think I forgot something. Yes, I did forget something. I did forget something. I did forget something. Um, 
times i times i times j. Um, okay, and what happened to the cut-in image? Cut-in patchily. Did he? Wow, it's patchy, not patchily. Um, yeah. Oh crap. Um, yeah. So you can see that some really un unwanted ha stuff happened with those um, different colored lasers. That's actually something that act happens in Don Makfu. You I can't really do much about it. Um, and wow, this is really congested. I'm going to change this. Um, yeah. That happens with the lay lasers sometimes. You can can't really do much about it. Um, you can implement them in a different way. I don't actually know what causes that. Uh, let's see. 20 is too much. 10 might be possible to dodge. No. Mm -hmm. Now it's doable. And it's static because of the way I set it up. Okay. Let's see. So I guess now I'm going to turn it into something more interesting than just laser. I mean, not really lasers, just bullets following the static pattern. First, I'm going to double that to 36. I'm going to start this off by an offset around 0, 10 plus which will <clears throat> give it something different. And I don't know if expanding the wolf will fix the problem. Sometimes it makes this less obvious. And no, it doesn't fix the problem. Oh, it did, temporarily. Um, yeah, this is completely, like, random-ish. I don't... And wow, oh yeah, because there's off by an offset. That's the reason why they're going weird. Um, yeah, this looks better. Although it's stupid. Wow, I'm grazing so. 100 grays already? Wow. Okay. Wait, are they even spawning correctly? No, they're not spawning correctly. Um, when I do this, I make a local variable. Um, I send i in 0 to 10, that goes across. Let random equals that. Um, this variable will only last for the actual ascent loop, and they will be deleted. So don't you don't have to worry about that. Um, that should, that should make it more stable. Um, and now I'm going to add some Apache to actually do. I'm, I'm going to remove this and put it into somewhere else. Okay, I'm not going to move it from here. Hmm. Ascent. Okay. I have an idea. Uh, loop. 8, 12, something less. Yes. And I'm going to add weight in here, so weight of 30. Water, no. No, I already did that. I mean, this. Oh. Mm, okay. And this is task B. I'm going to change this up a bit so that doesn't. Um, 360, no, four, 480. This is. Okay, ish. Doesn't really matter because she's not spawning the bullet, so it doesn't matter where she is. Um, I will have to time task B so that she is not moving during the actual spawning, because otherwise it may cause problems. Um, and I want this to look pretty. Um, let's see. First, I need to find an angle, so I have an angle to deal with. And also, you can see that I always use angle with T, that's because they're in tasks. 
Um, it is a habit I got into, and I don't plan on stopping that habit because it does help. And a different kind of delay laser won't really do much of anything. Um, get enemy X, object boss, get enemy Y. Um, let's see. The angle is going to be angle T, um, 1024. 36, 0, 1007, I'll give it a different color anyways, it's just so that there's some variety. 1007, aqua, 1009, and I'll give it 45, and I'll change, actually I'll change this to 30 because it's just a precaution. Um, and it doesn't really do much. And wow, I didn't even have- You don't actually need this, but you should put a semicolon afterwards anyways. How did it- Oh, because John Makfu doesn't break up the error if you have a closing bracket right after it. Brace, excuse me. Um, I'll just create a delay laser. And I'm actually going to task this. Yeah, I'm, I have really bad task names. I'm gonna pass angle T to it. Um, X, okay, no other variables. Okay, weight, um, 30. And I'm gonna spawn some really fast bullets. Um, I'm gonna make them pretty, let's see. Um, aqua, PCB, large bullets. Not dots, bullets. Um, I don't know which ones are better. Uh, aqua, 287, that's going to be 787. 787. Okay. Um... Hmm. I'm gonna make those decelerate just for added effect. Um, negative zero point zero five. Um, up to th down to three. That won't conflict. That will conflict a little bit. Uh, it doesn't matter. Three is a minimum speed. This moves elsewhere. And delay, I'm going to use I times 3. Close that. Okay. Um, what else? I'll play a sound effect for that. Okay. This will control both the delaying, delay lasers and the actual bullet set form. And I'm not incrementing angle, which is a bad idea. Uh, I will not use 787. I will use the th ones before, which is 729. 779, excuse me. Um, wow, I should really have fixed that. Plus equals. I'm not going to make it go in a circle. Um, I'll use a prime number just to vary it up and a relatively wide um, um, implementation. And that's not large enough. Wow, I actually survived that. That's amazing. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna make this better. Yeah, spell development takes a while. You really have to be prepared to spend some time fixing it up, changing things. Um, especially since, since some Doing this without a plan at all. Uh, 17 seems to be too little. I can, in fact, lip 3. Well, not with the weight there, though. Um, 3. And then I can angle t plus equals 365 3, which will 
copy the loop and that will make it more interesting. There. Um, this is not actually that terrible, <laughs> which is surprising. Okay. Um, so that's basically, I basically use delay lasers in both parts of the spell. And as you can see, you can use them for spawning. You can actually use them for lasers, which is the actual purpose. Or um, use them for this kind of thing, where you have bullets travel along the path of the laser, just to warn the player that it's coming along. And, yeah. A lot of scripters use this, and it's a pretty powerful technique. Well, everybody, thank you for watching. I hope you found this helpful. And I know it went on pretty long. Uh, I don't need this anymore. Um, but, yeah. Note that this spell is pretty uninspiring. <laughs> um, it's not that great of a spell. And, um, now the tutorial, this tutorial playlist is found on the Dunmuck, not, not there, not there, um, main page, oh, pre-4a, what? There's a pre-4a? Oh. Okay then. Looks like there's another version of Dunmuck for out that I don't have and I didn't know about. But he uses, usually uses, like, pre-4 test 1 or something like that. Anyways, um, Hmm. And yes, this is a download link for um, PH3. And oh, he just replaced P4 entirely. Wow. Okay, um. To functions tutorials. Helepolis' tutorials are right here, like always. My new tutorials are not here. I'm not gonna be. Probably not gonna be updating that for a while. And um. Yeah. Um. This video is gonna be uploaded to this playlist which is here on my channel. And yeah, I'm gonna be adding this soon. Also on Maze of the Clyde School, I think Halepolis may have actually put it up, I'm not sure. Oh, totally scratching his computer, I need to go back to that. Um, he may have updated the sticky, I do not know if he actually did. Um, but you can also find it on Maze of the Clyde School. I have it on my thread. And yeah. If you enjoyed this, um, please continue watching. If there are more, there probably will be. And do feel free to comment if you found anything interesting, um, want to suggest something, or etc. So, yeah. Over now. Bye.